The Motor Vehicle Insurance Limited announced the final dividend for the financial year 2021. Chief Executive Officer Michael Makap said the effects of the Russia-Ukraine war resulted in the disruptions of supply chains for the imports of new vehicles. MVIL recorded a net profit of the tax of 74 million kina, which is a reduced profit of 14 percent compared to the previous year. CEO Makap made the announcement. So MVIL's uh, business has been impacted as well, uh, but we, we have actually embraced a lot of uh, efficiency in the way we do things and cost control is probably one of the major issues that we've, we have uh, brought in and uh, as a result we saw our bottom line has delivered profit not as good as what we'd like and also as good as what we have actually delivered in the last three four years and so that leaves us with a balance which uh, we now are uh, paying it's 16.8 million and so that brings us to a total of 36 uh, million kina as 2021 uh, dividend. Kumul Consolidated Holdings Managing Director Professor David Kavanamur acknowledged the contribution of MVIL as a state-owned entity. I'd like to, on behalf of uh, KCH Management, I'd like to thank uh, the Motor Vehicle uh, CEO and, and the Chairman. Minister responsible for state enterprises, William Duma, commended MVIL Board of Directors and Management Team. MVIL will be the second uh, such SOE to uh, do very well in terms of uh, declaring dividends and uh, receiving net operating uh, profit of the tax of more than 50 million. And the professionalism of the board, led by our chairman and his directors, and the CEO led by Markup and his team. Motor Vehicle Insurance Limited paid an interim dividend of 20 million kina in August this year. Today's payment of 16.8 million kina adds up to 36.8 million kina for the 2021 financial year.